With the old home state gold mine, the town of Leed has a rich history. At this weekend's Gold Camp Jubilee, you can learn all about it. Tonight, Kelloland Sydney Thorson gives you a sneak peek of one of the many stories you'll hear at the Plain Speaking event. Leed, South Dakota, is filled with stories, many of them historically unique to the home state gold mine. Today, 92 year old Evelyn Murdy is sharing her home state story. Pasties were a dish that they could. Put in their buckets and take it down in the deep mines down in Cornwall. And it became a standard dish in most of the mining co uh, com communities. At a young age, she helped cook pastries for miners. She continues to make them to this day. They're put in a dough, and there's uh, uh, meat, potatoes. Sometimes turnips or rutabagas. They're their own thing and they're delicious. You have to have them at least once a week. Evelyn is one of the speakers at Plain Speaking People. Producer Kim Bartling and her team go into communities to find neighbors and families to share their best stories. To me, this is at the core of what great uh, stories should be because they're real with real people. And uh, I think in a world where right now we have so many stories that divide us. These are stories that bring us together. We recognize that in one another, but yet they're things that we might not have known. There will be eight speakers at the event on Friday night. Each of them get to speak for around eight minutes about their personal experiences with homestake mining. Whether they were making pasties or they were down in the trenches, um, but telling that one great story to share with not only the entire community of you know, the, the greater Black Hills. But I think also for me as a grandma, really important that their families hear them, Let's tell the story in their own voice. In lead, Sydney Thorson, Kelloland News. The event is at 6 p.m. on July 5th as a part of the Gold Camp Jubilee July 4th celebration. They're also featuring local musician Hank Harris for their pre and post show.